Hey, what's going on, everybody? Matthew from TheRightTrader.com here. We're going to be taking a look at Filecoin, and I'm going to be doing a price prediction in 2023 and beyond for this. Now, Filecoin, uh, I just pulled up the top performers in the last seven days, has been a very strong outperformer, up 68% in the last seven days alone. Uh, that made it, you know, a top five outperformer. And this is when crypto was pumping, right? Uh, Bitcoin ETH got a really good pump this week. So Filecoin has outshined the rest. Uh, it's at a $3.2 billion market cap rank 25 right now. So it is climbing back up the rankings. And what I absolutely love about this coin is uh, this is a coin that has been around for a while now. Um, now, I believe it's been around for even longer than it's appearing on, uh, on CoinGecko here maybe mistaken on this but i remember this coin being around for a while and it does seem to have a pretty strong fan base now it took a rough turn uh several months ago and has really been downtrending but we have finally got the first bit of hope and seeing how much this coin has pumped in the past okay historically right over here you can see an example of that uh it makes me very very optimistic for what could be ahead uh, for Filecoin. Now, there's a lot of stuff that you need to know about this project. Uh, you know, just a brief rundown of what it is. It's a decentralized storage network. Um, so that is what they're working on. Uh, they also have plans of launching a virtual machine. So some pretty cool stuff. I like the uh, the space that they're in, right? Cloud storage. Um, and, you know, this is really the leader in that area uh, as far as crypto goes. So there is more to... Uh, what meets the eye as far as why it pumped so much this week okay filecoin and storage these are two of the most popular cloud storage coins uh, outperformed bitcoin amid increased use in decentralized storage protocols but that's not it okay uh, on top of this uh we can see that and this is really the main reason i'd say is that there is a lot of hype about china buying into crypto okay now uh, i'm talking about you know, uh, even the average retail Chinese traders getting into crypto. Now, there's a reason for that, right? This week, we got very big news about Hong Kong allowing their citizens to trade large cap crypto assets. OK, we know that this could lead to billions of people coming into crypto. And uh, what we'll notice here is that crypto projects popular with Chinese development teams have soared, right? And that includes none other than Filecoin, right? Making it one of the best performers and one of the top performers in this whole China narrative. Now, you can see here that, you know, uh, the more actions US takes against crypto, the more the narrative is reinforced and introduces more shorts to enter the market that need to buy back higher. Uh, basically, this, uh, this whole Chinese, uh, you know, buying up crypto is, is uh, seeming to cause quite a lot of bullishness in the market, especially for coins that are more related to that uh, area of crypto, right? The Asian markets. I wanted to show you that we have actually now, uh, you know, even since a while back, I mean, this was a very slow and drawn out downtrend, but we have, you know, by all means, pretty much broken out of this downtrend, okay? Um, you know, I have trouble even drawing this downtrend properly because it was so slow and, and extended. But I'd say anywhere since back here, right, we, we started to stabilize. We got one last drop. And since then, it's really been off to the races. OK, we are now up 255 uh, percent and zooming out. You can see potentially what's ahead. Now, looking at the market cap of this coin, right, our peak market cap was around 12 billion. Uh, we're at 3 billion right now. I think it would be very, very uh easy for filecoin especially with this new chinese narrative and everything to get back into this uh this sort of middle range here between you know 40 and uh maybe even 80 dollars at the peak high right so i'd expect that peak to come around during the next bull market but drawing a rectangle here uh i'm gonna kind of draw the target range of what i'd expect okay so i'd really say anywhere in this range is probably where we're going to be heading uh, once the bull market comes around, we'll probably make some good progress even before that, right? Because this is a really a coin that's at rock bottom. So quite easily, I'd say we can make our way back to $10, $15, um, before that. And, uh, and it really should not be that hard for this coin with uh, the hype, with the bull market to enter this range again. Okay. Uh, like I said, peak high, probably, 
around $80, but we know this type of coin, right? It would not be uh, surprising either if we were to even go as high as 100 bucks. I don't necessarily think it could sustain those price levels, but like I said, right, even getting back into this range is a very nice move, and long term, it definitely, definitely uh, is an interesting coin to look out for, okay? A coin that has managed to stay in the top 100 for quite some time, now back in the top 25, uh, I had to make a video on it, okay? This is really interesting stuff, especially with all this, um, this new uh, bullish Chinese news, and of course, right, uh, all their updates in terms of their project with decentralized storage, virtual machines. I actually pulled up a tweet here, uh, the top 10 weekly GitHub activity, okay? This shows the developer activity for different coins, and you'll notice that although it is not one of the most, uh, Filecoin is in the top 10, and I think that is, you know, something worth... Um, it's right behind Ethereum, right? So I think it shows that people are working on this project. It shows that uh, they're making improvements. They're uh, growing the project. And like I said, I like the space they're in. I think there's a use case for this. I think there's a lot of use case for virtual machines. machines. And this uh, Chinese narrative is huge for this coin. And of course, um, you know, uh, this is something that could cause these type of coins to fly right especially if they maybe have limited access to only a certain set amount of coins uh you know like they said the the large cap coins or whatnot uh it could get very very interesting right i feel like the asian markets are going to stick with the more asian based coins uh or, or coins that are related to the asian markets like i said and that could really cause coins like filecoin more specifically to fly right and the proof is what happened this week up 68 percent on the beginning of this news in just seven days okay that's basically 10 percent a day so a lot of potential there uh i do like filecoin especially at these lower levels right now um you know i would not have necessarily said to be buying filecoin up here but down here at the rock bottom prices i think the risk reward is very good on this not financial advice just my own personal opinion make sure to smash that like button uh subscribe leave a comment what do you think is going to happen and i'll see you all very soon thanks for watching everybody have a great day